Hello, my wonderful people. Good morning to you all. Anywhere you are watching this video, and I welcome you to God's Love You channel, the home of news. Here, we react to all forms of videos, local, international, especially what is happening in the entire world. So, if you like this kind of program, kindly subscribe. Put on your notification bell to all notifications. I promise you, you will never regret for subscribing to this wonderful platform. So, my great people, I have come to react again. I want you to sit down and listen to this wonderful message from our one and only Prime Minister of Biafra government in exile, Obata Obie. If you don't know what is going on in this Biafra struggle, I want you to cool down. I'm not going to talk too much. Let's listen to this. Then we'll come to the comment section. You are free to criticize, like I always say. You are free to correct. You are free to drop your opinion. But let us do it constructively as I will be here. We will listen to this together and we'll go to the comment section to air our mind. Thank you. Land to criminals, terrorists, bandits, Fulani terrorists, and rather provide vital information to the Biafra Defense Forces that helps to apprehend and neutralize them. You are our heroes today, the 30th day of May 2024. For the very first time in the history of Biafra liberation after the war, the government of Biafra did it fit to recognize and celebrate those, both the living and the dead. Biafra, the single mothers, single fathers who work tirelessly to provide for their children in Biafra land and beyond, in the midst of Nigeria terrorist state hardship, you are our heroes today. All of you, the single mothers and single fathers in Biafra land, that some of you that Nigeria state terrorism has rendered widows and widows, you are all our heroes today. You sit at home that is being observed in the entire Biafra territory today is to celebrate you and those who have lost their life, who we have lost in the course of this struggle, is also to mourn your dead. To the Biafra teachers who go extra mile to inspire and inspire young minds and have always observed our seat at home, since 2021, you are our heroes today, 30th day of May 2024. The sit at home today, civil disobedience, everything is to celebrate you, teachers in Biafra land. To the young Biafrans, to the young Biafra people who take charge of their own lives and take up responsibility of training their own siblings because of failed state of Nigeria and of course because their future has been bastardized and with taking care of these siblings you secure a better future for them because the country Nigeria has given them hopeless. They make them hopelessness and you the young people who wake up to take challenges responsibility of your parent who Nigeria has rendered useless you are our heroes and heroes today the 30th day of May 2024 for the very first time the government of Biafra applauds the doggedness resilience and your every effort you put to make sure you raise Biafrans from different quarters of the world Everyone can understand that Nigeria not only decayed, but has failed. And of course, we celebrate the failure and the collapse state of Nigeria because it goes to our advantage. The citizens who care for the environment by pro properly disposing of garbages 
in Biafra land and within Biafra territory, you are our heroes and heroes. We celebrate you today. To the healthcare workers in Biafra land, doctors, nurses, midwife, and what have you, who care for the ill, you are our heroes. Because without you, probably Nigeria may have a neglected large number of Biafra people, but we rely on our self-help, which the healthcare workers has contributed one of the most important role in making sure we preserve ourselves and save our generation up to this point. You are our hero. The Biafra Liberation Army and Biafra Resistance Fighters, the Dragon Marine, Biafra Navy, and all the armed group of the Biafra Defense Forces that have put themselves in the harm way to ensure our safety in Biafra land against a terrorist state of Nigeria. You are our heroes. And today, 30th May 2024, we do not just celebrate those who have fought and died, but we celebrate you who are still alive, standing very tall and still fighting. You are the heroes of Biafra. Those of you who have funded the Biafra Liberation Army from 2021 till date, you are the most important of them all at this present day. You are the most important heroes and heroines of Biafra today. And therefore, we celebrate you on this day, the 30th day of May 2024, specifically and specially. If you have funded the Biafra up to this point, everything happened today is to celebrate you. The Biafra children who assist their friends and colleagues at school, who may be in distress, all of you who showed brotherly love to your friends, relatives at school, you are our hero. Many of you have done that in your early days. And today, the people you help in school has become one of those that is making the Biafra freedom and independence possible today. So, you are our hero. And those of you who still have kids going to school, encourage them to help each other when they are at school and when their friends are in distress, especially in the Biafra land. That particular love is needed at this point. Every cabinet member of the Biafra Republic government in exile, today is your day. As of the heroes of Biafra, we regard you, the cabinet members of the Biafra Republic government in exile, that you are heroes and heroes of Biafra. And today, we celebrate you. Every civil disobedience today is to celebrate you. Those who have left us in the course of this struggle from the Biafra Republic of Medicine Exile. Today, we use the civil disobedience and every activities today to remember you, remember your, your, your resilience, your support. We also mourn those that have left us. To every Biafra being detained today for Biafra agitation and those in the dungeon, you are our heroes and hearing, and everything that we do today is to honor you, celebrate you. You will be alive to see Biafra, and you will be free one day. And your continued detention and incarceration will always bring doom to Nigeria. It's our promise. They will never go free by abducting, kidnapping, detaining, justly,
thousands of Biafra, including the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Mazen and Bekano. The more they detain you, the more Nigeria will face calamity. It's a promise.